Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Ellie Snake Lady and today as you can see I'm joined by Artemis and she was just hiding up in her little fairy lights and I've got her out and disturbed her but uh, yeah I've got her out today um, just for a bit of handling so she gets used to me because she's still a little bit flighty. Uh, pretty much how Sklepin used to be when he was a baby as well so um, Anyway, today I'm going to just be doing a little haul of bits and bobs for her tank. Um, there's a little feeding video involved in this video as well, just of her eating. So anyone with a sensitive stomach, uh, watch out for that. I will give a warning though beforehand. Um, and yeah, and I'm just going to show you what her tank looks like now with everything put in it and one thing and another and just her settling in really so um but yeah so we're gonna have a bit of handling and sort that lot out <laughs> anyway so yes yeah, so i hope you enjoy this video and thanks very much for watching it's going to be a mixture of like a swell reptiles haul and um also a packaged pets um haul but this is like such a tiny mini haul of stuff because it's just a few extra bits for Artemis and her tank. So uh, she's just eaten, so I've just fed her. And I'm going to leave her for a couple of days before I put this stuff in her tank and actually I'm going to clean her out I'm kind of in the middle of cleaning out my snakes so I've done the four my four corn snakes behind me and I've got Artemis my other little corn snake as I say to clean out um, I'm going to do a strayer this afternoon and then the boys in a couple of days because they've just eaten as well so anyway yes without any further ado I shall just get on with that and uh, thanks very much for watching Okay, so let's start off with the Swell Reptiles uh, haul or, you know, a few little bits that I've got. Um, so I've received these little half log hide things. They're made from resin. Um, I'll be putting up the sizes and the price and all the rest on the screen. So I can't remember how much they cost for each of these, but they're really like heavy and sturdy and you know they're not easy to like flip over or anything like that so yeah so i've got one two <laughs> and number three so i've got three of those because all my corn snakes have these and australia's got one in her uh, tank as well my mexican black king snake she's got uh, three of these as well and um, they're just great for snakes to move around in their tanks and hide if they need to and one thing or another a lot of my, um, well, my two girls tend to sleep in their logs, uh, their log hides. So, uh, yeah, so these are really good and I would definitely recommend them. They're easy to clean. They look natural. Um, and, yeah, they're just perfect. So this is the smaller size. Apparently, Swell Reptiles does do a bigger version of these log hides, but um, I've never seen them. I've only ever seen these small ones. So yeah, but they're great. So I would definitely recommend these. Right, so the next thing we have is this lovely water bowl. It's massive, I know. And that is um, by Exoterra. It's an extra large water bowl. Um, this is obviously for Artemis to grow into. Um, you know, when she does become an adult and that, she'll be, you know, she'll fit perfectly in that. But at the moment, it'll just be like a really massive swimming pool for her. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, when I clean her out, I'm going to put this in. I'm going to clean it up, put water in it and put it in her tank and stuff. So, yeah, yet again, I'll be putting up the sizes and prices and everything on the screen. So, yeah, that's that. So, it's a really sturdy water bowl yet again it can't be flipped over um or anything like that it's easily cleaned it looks natural and yeah it fits so well in their tanks as well so i love them but yeah anyway that's that so last but not least um 
I have got something from Package Pets and it is a wooden hide. Um, so I got this from Package Pets and it is by Trixie. You can see that there. It is really for like hamsters and you know mice and gerbils and stuff like that but um, my snakes do use these quite a lot of my other snakes so yet yeah, again it's something for Artemis to use she can grow into it looks natural it's fairly easy to clean granted it's not a smooth surface because it is wood but I just cover it in disinfectant and dab it down and just leave it to dry and stuff but um, yeah these are great so um, I'll be putting this in when I clean out her tank as well so that's the top I've got like the little underneath bit as well so yeah these are really well made and even if any bits do come off you know me being the DIY girl um, I'll just you know either hammer a small nail in or put some um, non-toxic hot glue and glue bits back on but generally these are fine they last a long time and yeah I love them so and so do the snakes as well they love hiding in them so yeah so that's that so today, um, about half past nine this morning, I got a delivery of frozen mice from Swell Reptiles. So um, they package their um, frozen food really, really well. You know, lots of ice packs and whatnot um, and paper to wrap around it and one thing or another. So uh, I got some hopper mice um, and I also got some medium mice generally from other corn snakes. This is Artemis's tank now. She's got that wooden hut at the back like the others have got and she's got a really big nice water bowl there to swim around in and drink from and whatnot. The usual little hides there that I made. There's the logs at the back there as you can see. All their foliage and ferns and whatnot, grass tunnels, cave hide and the platform thing that you can see that wooden platform thing and her rope bridge as well so uh, yeah it's all looking pretty good so I'm just going to get her and put her in oh, my little girl there we go hello I know you're not happy with mummy I know I know oh you're okay <laughs> There we go, little girl. She needs to get used to being held as well, so. <laughs> okay. No, you can't go up there. <laughs> She's trying to get up there. There we go. <laughs> She'll have a lot of new things to look at. Let's move her a bit. There we go. I'll leave her to it for now. Yeah, so as you can see, she's um, settling in really nicely into her um, you know her new sort of setup and all the rest of it and uh, she is into climbing into the foliage and sleeping there as well as climbing up into the lights and sleeping there she's not one for really sleeping in her hides at the minute but i'm sure she'll uh, do that eventually you know but um anyway yeah so she's been really still really good so anyway i'm lucky at the minute but uh, yeah so anyway if you did enjoy this video then please like and subscribe and when you do subscribe please hit that bell notification and click all so you get notifications for my latest videos and if you have any comments or questions or anything like that then just pop them in the comment section below and I'll do my best to answer them but for now from myself and a squiggly Artemis ooh, it is goodbye and we'll see you in my next video. Thanks very much for watching. Oh. <laughs>